you know, memory is a remarkable thing, and the way it can be manipulated for good and for ill is quite remarkable because of its inherent flexibility. What you see here is a cell from the hippocampus, which is the main organ of memory in the human mind, actually in all organs' minds. Thankfully, our nervous system is designed to be flexible so that it can learn about the world and modify its understanding of the world. You see, all the time we're learning, we have a little model of the world in our brains which actually predicts what we're going to see so that when something is different, we notice it right away. It's a very efficient system of staying alert to threats. And so brain scientists these days actually refer to the brain as a prediction machine. But that also means that the brain, to be efficient, has to throw away a lot of information it judges to be irrelevant and unimportant. And thus, I say that for a good memory, forgetting is a feature. It's not a bug. In short, memory is the raw material of ourselves as individuals and as members of society. It comprises our identity. In effect, to hijack history is tantamount to identity theft, and it is, to my mind, a political crime, whoever commits it. Thank you.